Hey guys, fat fuck here. I ate a lot of food before recording this episode. So my stomach's kind of going, hey. Suicide. The gum. Right, gum. Oh, there I know. Look at you guys. Wait, don't go. Please. Sorry, dude. Can't help you. You're on your own. Uh oh. There's some commotion going on over there. Let's check it out. Say none of my business. We got beef with her and talk to her yourself, you creep. I'm begging you. Is that going to give it back? She won't listen to me. Wait. Is that. Oh shit. That's Basil. Leave him alone, you bully. Hmm? Who's there? Oh, it's just Kel. <sighs> what did you mind your own business? Why don't you go why don't you go bar someone else, Kim? <laughs> why aren't well, aren't you acting all high and mighty? We don't make you don't make the rules around here. What's going on over there? Oh, Jesus. Aubrey? Why are you such a fucking delinquent here? Oh, hey, Aubrey. Nerd killed and showed up and think you can boss me around. It's almost what's what? Hell, what do you want? Stop messing with Basil. How could you? We always be friends, don't you remember? Tell her, Sonny. Sonny's here? Wow, it really is you. It's been a while, but you haven't changed a bit. How long have it been since you left your house? Three years? Maybe four? Must have been nice to live in your own little bubble. Watch it, Aubrey. You don't know what he's been through. Hmm, whatever. Aubrey, please, listen to me. Hey, stop that! Let it, leave it alone, kill. This isn't your problem. What the heck is wrong with you, Aubrey? <sighs> Sonny! Come on, we gotta do something. <laughs> Are you guys really picking a fight? Sure, why not? Two of you against me, how's that sound? Come at me! I'll take on both of you. How far are you gonna run while I do this? Gah! What the? Is is that a knife? Oh, shoot. Barbara, are you okay? You're, you're hurt. I I'm fine. No, you're not. You're bleeding. Come on, we're gonna get you out of here. Uh, I'll get you back for this.
Well, that was about to get really messy. If you had your knife there, it would have been. Wait, wait, wait a sec. Give me that. Tell took away your steak knife. You need to be carrying things around like that, Sonny. That's dangerous. I was really changed you last saw her. Her new, her and her new friends have been nothing but trouble. Poor Basil. It's like we took care. Fuck you. Hey Basil, how are you doing? Uh, I'm fine. Thank you, Kel. I don't even notice, but Sunny's here too. Say hi, Sunny. Oh, S hey, Sunny. You know what, having it. <laughs> Woohoo! What a happy reunion! So, do you want to hang out with us today? Uh, I'm sorry. I would love to, but I should probably head home. Huh, really? You sure? Um, my grandma has been feeling too well lately. I'm sorry to hear that. Let's at least let walk you home. It's so long since we've been, uh, since we all hung out. Uh, oh, all right then. Thank you. Well, can I at least use to try uh, go to the old lady for a bit? Um, where, where do you guys going to drop me off? Okay, because we gotta keep the trash on us. So your home is this way? That's the way to Bassa's house. Remember, Sunny, it's the street that's diagonal from our crosswalk. Diagonal? Ah. Uh. Oh, gee, I wonder. There's Basil's house. Is that the one with the... Gr it's that one with the green roof. Um, thanks for walking me home. No problemo. If you ever need anything from me, just ask, okay? We'll catch up. We'll catch you later, Basil. Uh, okay. Hmm? Wait, please don't go! Uh, I mean, I... I'm so sorry. I have to have a favor to ask. Anything, Basil. What do you need? Well, you see, something important was taken from me. When we used to be friends, do you remember how I used to take pictures of everyone? Oh, of course I remember. That's what has meant everything to you. Uh, right. Well, Aubrey, she took my photo album and... Aubrey stole your photo album? Well, she, she won't give it back. What a scumbag! Don't worry about a thing, Basil. Me and Sonny got you covered. Uh, okay. Thank you. By the way, what we said before. We're still friends. A way to not out, okay? Okay. Well, I'll see you later. Come on, Sonny. There's no time to lose. We got a photo album to find. Let's check for our wake park for clues. All right. Cat! Is that... Hey? Huh?
Okay, I think we're sort of high. A lot of stuff from the Dream World is kind of becoming illusion in our eyes. Oh, the freaking wormhole. Seashells, seashells, by the seashells. Seashells, seashells, by the seashells. That's incorrect. I read it correctly. <gasps> Witches. God, I'm stupid. Can we still go to that place? Please? 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 Hell yeah. Can I use the drill coin in the fountain? Yes! Quinn fell straight to the bottom. Ha! Alright, let's look for clues here. That tree is shaking. Mm, I think I'm breathing here. Oh, wait, I know you. Your name is Charlie, right? I see you hanging around Aubrey sometimes. You know where she is? You know, Charlie, I can tell you're not the mean type of person. Aubrey took some important from Boston. We need to get it back. Anything, is there any way you can help us? Nani? Who, what, where now? What are you that for? Ah, uh, if he didn't kill and that weird knife guy. Where do you ever say they were the great and mighty angel? Finally, it's that for you to meet your doom. Angel, we don't have time for this. We just want to find Aubrey. You know where she is? You seek Aubrey, do you? Interesting. I'll tell you what I know. But first, you must best mean battle. But battle? But I don't want to punch a kid. You won't be able to lay a finger on me. Come on, come on. Let's sick him, Charlie. <laughs> Yo, Charlie. Fucking thick. I had to take my knife, bud. You had to take my knife. How much can I raise my shit? Okay, cool. Mouth in your mouth. Hey, you surprised me, Kill. You make a very right for a master. All right, just attack, Char. Just attack, uh, Angel over here. You, you'll pay for this. How could this be? My training was all for nothing. 
Oh, my head hurts. You're the one who started it. You bully! <sighs> okay, Angel, it's time to be serious now. We beat you in Charlie, so that's where Aubrey is. Hmm. Promise of promise, I suppose. I wonder if I want to tell you what I know. The truth is, Aubrey is somewhere in a faraway town. Probably. Dang it, Angel! Better not be messing around or else. I told you, I know what I know. I told you what I know. And the truth is, I don't know anything. Angel, better tell us where she is right now. Or I'll tell everyone about the time you were at your bed at summer camp. Oh, 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 you can't do that. That's cheating. Anyways, I really don't know. Maybe you can ask my master, the, ma the Maverick, the keeper of all knowledge. He told me that himself. The, the, the Maverick? Oh, no. You mean the weird kid, Mikkel? Don't you dare call him by the name! You would take great offense to that. I see. So it is him. Where can I find Mik I, I, I mean, the Maverick. I'll tell you what I know, but you have to fight me, to f fight me first. Or I can tell everyone the time you. Gah! Fine, fine, I'll talk. Master went to the fountain at Faraway Plaza. He said he was going to meet someone, uh, some, uh, some girl there for a date or something. <sighs> Disgusting. Come on, Sonny. Let's go to Faraway Plaza. I think we're done here. 20 out of 20. Buy some fruit. No, that that would be that would do this. Fuck it. Yes, drink apple juice! You enjoy it. This guy, second, this guy fucking reminded me of that freaking other guy. It's kind of scary me. Um. Vending machine. Come on, I want to buy a vending machine. Anyways, I'm going to pause, use the bathroom, and be right back. Alright, let's head to that fountain. Bruh. And I told him, it's not Maverick, it's THE Maverick. Oh, the Maverick, you're so funny. Wow, what an amazing story, the Maverick. Girls, girls, please, that's enough of me to go around. You are a fuckboy, if I ever seen one. Mikkel, what are you doing? Ah! If it isn't Mikkel, my... Art nemesis. Finally, you're doing defeat, are you? I don't have time for this, Mikkel. We're looking for Aubrey. Have you seen her? Stop following me, that! Cast away that name a long time ago. Mikkel, do you know where she is or not? Give yeah, us that godforsaken name! How dare you make a fool out of me! I am never gonna stand for this! I'm gonna face your doom! Watch this, ladies. I'll wipe the floor with these losers. Please, Mikkel, don't do this to yourself. I'm gonna ask you one more time. Fight me, you want! Don't be a chicken! <sighs> Are we really doing good to do this? Hey then, come on, Slayer, let's take him down. Oh, he even looks like a fuck boy. I was in a fucking care and draw in, in the fucking actual drawn style. Oh, hell, you pitiful fool! You didn't stand a chance against the Maverick, bro. You look like you're you're going through a fucking hangover. Get yourself up. Courage. Good 
They're not gonna hit Sunny at all. Hmm. <laughs> not bad. This fight's getting started. All right. I have the back of my rival, but I must tell you, while you're fooling around to play sports, I am in honor to just for this moment. You're never reach my level of skill. You're going down, Kale. Starts bragging to his adoring fans. Hey, is that all you got? What am I using 10% of my power? Behold, my final form! I bet you're regretting your decision now. He's way too cool for you. You're nothing but a loser. It's only a matter of time before you tire yourself out. My victory is imminent. Bro, you have not touched Sunny at all. Oh, I'm it. I'm impressed. We're still light years away from defeating me. Ah, ah, no, this is impossible. Improbable. Absolutely inconceivable. God, no, I want to end like this. No, can't be over for me. People love motherfucker. Let me your strength. Oh yeah. Ew, what is with this guy? He's so lame. This isn't worth ten dollars. Let's get it all. L -l Ladies, please come back. I have more money. Mm. Oh, it's a wig! Hey, Cal. There is no one here by that name! Please, I never ask you for anything again in my life. Still at the robbery, and we'll go. Okay, fun. You have to know what she is, and I'll tell you. I'm working with this one. You must call me by my true name, the Maverick! Okay, forget it. Let's just go and find Kim. He probably knows where Aubrey is. Hair and Vance are a major circuit, head, so I have a hunch you're probably somewhere near Candy. That, that determination to not call this man by that stupid name. Oh. How much money do I have? Seven bucks? Bro, we need to get you healed. Huh? My penny food is the only vehicle for sauce. There's only tons of tam uh, tamales on the market now. I need any fan stuff. Canned tamales are good enough for me. Rusayo? My husband keeps eating junk food. I need to make sure he has a healthy meal. My mom and I are buying healthy stuff at other markets. She threw away all the snacks in the house yesterday. She's been in a health grace since dad's been only eating junk food lately. Why can't we do both? All the containers in the section can be recycled to create new containers over and over again. Such a beautiful concept, isn't it? My son Billy is such a stickler for the environment. He and his friends are always picking up trash around town. It's gonna see so many young people these days taking care of the planet. What is this over here? <gasps> you guys need anything for cutting scratches? Yes.
All right, fuck white. Let's go. Two apple trees are really made for the ripest of apples. What is this other thing we got, dude? Alright, whatever. Hey, this case. A single bandage, not a box of bandages. That would be one dollar for like a pack of three. Nah, just a single bandage for a dollar. Bruh, that's a scam if I ever heard one. Hmm, no, we came in an answer. Probably somewhere around here. Oh, there she is. Hurry, man, just sip it out in the pocket before someone sees us. Hey, Kim, have you seen Aubrey any... Shoot, it's that nerd, Kill! Come on, Vance, we gotta go! Well, hold on there. I don't think you paid for those. Get out of my way, nerd. You don't know me. Hey, hold on. I'm not here to snitch. We just need to find Aubrey. You know where she is? Huh? Aubrey? I don't know anything about that. Even if I did, I'm gonna tell you. So, I don't know if it is for today. Okay, I'm gonna make a deal. Then we're robbers, and I won't turn you in for stealing all that candy. Thanks, everyone, we're gonna snitch. Eh, you, you don't need to be. I don't need to be if you just tell me where Aubrey is. You two again? I thought I told you to never come back here. Smiley, smiley. Uh oh. Hand over all the stolen candy. Don't make me call the cops on you, kids. Smiley, smiley. We've been busted. Fine! Here's your stupid candy! Come on, Vance, get out of this dump. Ah, serve you right! Huh? Wait, how will we find out where Aubrey is now? Ah, come on, so let me just follow them. What up a sex, honey? I think I have an idea. Tell hold up for the hold up. Let's go catch up to Kim Advance. Peter. Where would they go? Oh. No rumble. Sorry, man. It's no candy today. No, not again. I don't know how much longer it can last. I die. Let's just go home. I'll be late for dinner. Wait, Kim. That's it for you. You're gonna kill what the heck do you want, you bully? Tell me where is, and I'll give you this whole bag, big bag of candy. Really? The whole bag? I mean, you can't buy us off with candy. What do you take us for? I don't know, Kim. We haven't had candy for an entire week, and there's a whole bag right in front of us. We don't even have to pay for it. We at least ask if he has any taffy in there. Stop it, Vance. We have to stay strong. We're going to have, we have all the candy we want. Okay, I'll do it for you, sis. Kim, Vance. I'm waiting. <laughs> like we also have candy from a bunch of nerds. Huh. Oh man, really? Oh, it's sure that would work. So with time, let's get out of here. Wait! Please, Kim, you're the only lead I've got. Please take the bag of candy. We we even have taffy in here. Someone did say taffy? I see. It changes everything. Fine. You really want to know that badly, huh? Let's start this with our fist! You win, I'll tell you where Aubrey is. But if we win, give us that bag of taffy and you never talk to us again. Wait a second, there's no need to fight. 
if you just tell me which you have, I'll give you this whole bag. But I want to fight. Come on, put him up, you two. It's time to duke it out. <sighs> what are the two of you guys in fighting? Uh, I guess we have no choice. Come on, Sonny. We know the drill. Where's the police and people calling, you know? Straight as five than anything. And I'm not about to lose two nerds like you. Bro, if I had a fucking knife right now. Kale, I'm disappointed in you. You could have given us... Kim's phone rang. It was the wrong number. Go after one of them. No point in coming down right now. You're going to talk, man. It's probably not going to do much damage. Okay, it's a whiff. Tell me, don't know yet. Your face annoys me. Finally, this boy gets attacked. Ouch, that hurts. Damn it, now I gotta put another bandage on you. I gotta put another can advantage on you again. Well, I'm out of bandages. Dang, all I wanted was some taffy. Okay, I blacked out. Okay. Oh, shit. Come on, Kim. We're going to go home. It's almost time for dinner, and Mom's gonna be really mad if we're late. Shoot, let's get out of here. Wait, don't go! Please, Kim, I know you know where Aubrey is. She's, she took something really important from Basil. I get that you guys are friends and stuff, but even you can admit that Aubrey goes too far sometimes. Please, you're trying to help a friend. Aubrey's at church. The one near her house. Huh? Aubrey's at church? Hey, don't look at me! You're the one who wanted to know. Oh, then she asked who told you, tell her it wasn't me. She's say it wasn't Mikel or something. Come on, Kim, we gotta go to, we gotta scoot. Don't want to get we're late. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Let's go. Come on, you later. Nerds! Oh, no, she took the bag of candy while I wasn't looking. So we got some bit, got some sticky fingers. Oh, well, at least we know where Aubrey is now. At least I think we do. Can't really imagine Aubrey at church, but I believe it when I see it. Bro, all we need is to heal.
Yeah, a, a little bit. We got fucked. Where would Aubrey's house be? Wait, was it going the right way? Hello? Let me tell you a story. I was walking back from Fix It after making a purchase with some hard money. When I looked down, an animal be home. And my new garden shears are missing. Yes, that's true. My new garden shears tore a hole within my plastic bag. I'll see you later, Fuzzy Do you think you could help me find them? It should be somewhere around here. I think we're actually physically high. You're going to see the red glasses, lady. Ah, oh, thank you, boys. You'll be sure to make make such a silly mistake again. It's pretty to see young boys wanting to help a strange leader these days. Pretty come to the house anytime. You're always welcomed. Healing? The way you're healing? I think I hear healing. Snip, 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 snip. Oh, hi there, you two. My name is Becky Susan. Check, look here. Caring for these moths is a hobby of mine. It helps me relieve stress. And it is, I want to start preparing dinner for my children. Kim and Vance tonight. You better not be late again, or else. How the fuck did we get here before them? <coughs> Excuse me, sorry to impose, but you look like some trustworthy people. Do you think you can help me? I need to pick up this week's medication in the pharmacy, and I'm a bit weak at the moment. Wait, is my daughter declaring the She's not here right now. Will you be so kind to pick it up for me? Huh. So there's like some minor side quest in the in uh, overworld. Interesting. Otherworld. Am I supposed to assume this is what's called? I don't have access to the hangman, I don't know you. I'm assuming there's not going to be any letters or anything of that sort. Hmm, hello. I'm going to help you. Ah, you're ready to pick up some medication. Oh, I know who this is for. I'll bring it right out. You're picking up her medication and picking up her daughter tonight? I'm just supposed to give up medication like this, but I usually make exception for her since she doesn't have a way to come here herself. Good for helping her out. You can have a nice day. Do we need bandage for kids? Kids, I got you covered here. So I'm assuming there's not actually a fucking lose thing. Probably would have getting you probably would have gotten different dialogue themes if you lose or not. But overall it's probably like you win or lose doesn't really matter. 
maybe until like later on for a more important thing, like maybe fighting Aubrey, but like, yeah. Oh, this is this is um, Basils. All right, Granny, Granny. There you are. Oh, you came back. Ooh. <coughs> Excuse me. Thank you so much. You've been a big help. It's nice to see that you've helped us, old folk. You're welcome to my house anytime. Huh. I think his daughter is usually so attentive of me. I wonder what she is. She's always been pretty quiet, but she's made a lot of new friends recently. What does it forget about me? Oh, she's friends with fucking Aubrey. No! Can I use my skills here? Nah. That would be too good. So the health layout is pretty much the same? Yeah. That lullaby. There's a love letter on this table. Hmm. Who could it be for? Well, we're not going to part too much. According to how long of this. Now, where would search be? How many were you gone down to the first house of this area? Nice for the shells. What a nice shit. We haven't checked this three yet. Under a very fucked up looking house. That's a dollar right there. Yo, do you know how many dollars that can be? Hmm. Well, here we are. It's really is the last place I would expect is her. Kind of skeptical, actually. Might be a trap. Open the door, take a little peek. Hmm, good sermon to me. For the of a sermon. Oh, there she is on the right. Hmm, she's just sitting there. Oh, normal, so weird. Yeah, I feel pretty bad about interrupting us. Can't wait until the sermon is over or something. Okay, let's wait here until the sermon's over. Aubrey's old blue bike. Far away from cemetery. More good sorting going on here. Such things have never changed.
Oh, I didn't expect you to walk in like that, Sonny. Well, there's no turning back now. Come on, we have to be really quiet. Right. Just walk to the pew behind her. Aubrey. Psst, Aubrey. What the? What the heck are you guys doing here? We want you to give up. We want you to give back Baffle the photo album. You still on about that? None of your business. Really? None of my business. We need to be best friends, but now this is none of my business? Yeah, Cal. Exactly. We used to be friends. <sighs> you know, Marty would be really sad to hear that. Eh, <sighs> really? Really want to bring Mari into this? She is dead! Who cares what Mari thinks? <gasps> Go it! Mari's dead. Aubrey, seriously? What's wrong with you? I get it that you have new friends. You just can't forget your old friends like that. My old friends. My old friends weren't there one for me when I needed them. That's what this is all about? When Mari passed on, we we're all dealing with our own stuff. We were kids. It was hard. You think it's so simple? You've always been simple, Kel. So what if I am? I'd rather be simple than be like you. How can you do that to Basil? You know how important his photo album is to him. It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you could just steal it. Is that what Basil told you? I'm the one keeping it safe. What are you talking about? That photo album belongs to Basil. I'm not letting you I'm not leaving until you agree to give it back. <sighs> You're so persistent. When Mari died, you moved on so fast. You know why I came come here every week? Even after all this time, I'm trying to find some peace. It doesn't look like it's happening today. We haven't talked in four years, Cal. A lot changed in four years. You and Sonny think you just barge into my life and tell me what to do? Don't be so naive! You might look different and act different, Aubrey. But you're still the same person. Hmm. The Aubrey you knew was long gone. The Aubrey that was your friend. She's long gone, too. Okay, fine. Get that you're angry. Look for the apology you want here. I'm sorry, okay? We should have been there when you lost Mari. Now, I won't accept this. Wait! Where are you going? Can you go until you promise to give us Basil's photo on back, you thief? What's happening? Basil, isn't that boy who... We've seen Aubrey and her friend's bully. Now she's stealing as well. Oops. You think you're the good guy, don't you, Kel? And I'm the big bad bully. Here to terrorize your def uh, poor defenseless Basil. You're the one hanging out with the psychopath who carries around a knife. Now's not the time to do this, Aubrey. You don't get to say that. You're the one who barged in here. I already said I was sorry for everything. You want to be want me to be the bully? Then I'll be a bully! You two better come at me quick. Or I'll come at you first! Is no one to stop this? Yeah, okay, so this is what I mostly expected. I called the fact that Mario was dead or hospitalized. We shouldn't do this in a church. Look at her clothing. Really inappropriate for church. Aubrey, why are you here? Can't believe you would bring a weapon in here. How uncivilized.
What are those delinquents think they're doing? This is a place of worship! Someone needs to stop them. Where are their parents? The girl's a threat to this neighborhood. There's no hope for sinners like her. <sighs> Save you right, Kale. Now, leave me alone! The damage has been done. Ah, ever since her father left. It's so uncomfortable. Controllable. Disrespectful. I feel bad for her mother. <laughs> Shoot. I know she's been kind of a mess, kind of been messed up lately. But I still feel sorry for her. Maybe that was a bad idea. Father, I'm sorry for we have sinned. She'd be at the park. Do you see that? I would just dump something into her trash can. Go check it out. Whoa, I don't believe it! It's Basil's photo album! Can't believe you just throw it away out throw it out like that. Good thing we looked through this trash can. On the bright side, at least we can have Basil's photo album now. You only look at half a day, too. How about teamwork? How about a high five, Sonny? Let's give this back to Basil before it gets dark. He's happy when he sees it. Knock knock! Basil! It's your friends, Ken and Sonny!
Oh, hello there. Who are you? Hi, Basil. Oh, wait. You're not Basil. I'm sorry. My name is Polly. I'm Basil's caretaker. Oh, hey, Count. What is it? Hey, Basil. Got your photo on my back. Uh, you, you did? Wow. Thank you. Basil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. You know, it's for dinner. I always seem to cook just a little too much. Dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Come on, Sammy. Free dinner. Save point. Please make yourself at home. I'll go ahead and finish up the food. Been a while since I've been in here. You definitely have a lot more plants than you used to. Uh, yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, there's some still alive from when you guys came here often. Wow, you sure are dedicated. Yep, that's baskets for you. Flowers in the photos. That reminds me. Now that we got your phone on back, we can go through all the photos together. Uh, that's a... Uh, I don't know. Been a while since we looked through them, hasn't it? Come on! It'll be fun! Um... Sure. Okay. Here it is. Now let's see the real life equivalent of these photos, shall we? Once it loads up. Hello? Game. Oh, there it is. My first photo. My best friend Sunny trying to cause a new violin. Certain neglected they can see any uh they play at recitals with Sister Mari. The music sheet. So exciting. Just kill being cow. So many party hats. Sunny playing on a, a video game on the couch. He's a little shy, but he's a really good listener. I can always end up venting him when I get upset or stressed. Just as I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. You're back in the park, but Kyo's still full of energy. He's not here to an armor thing match, but we all know it's gonna win. He's gonna use an event hero. Oof, sorry, Kyo. Better luck next time. Kyo's still feeling a little sorry for lo about losing the hero and armor thing la last night. So you decided to lean in for a smooch. Kyo looks so annoyed. Ah, brain love. Me showing Sunny a book I've been reading. Mari stole the camera and took this while they're paying attention. I think you better track on my things. So she dyed her hair pink. Aww. It's all of a cutting. It's all of us cutting sunny stuffed animals. It's not many, and you're all so soft. Why did they lay here forever? Mari's right, teaching everyone how to make frog crowns. Wow, okay, game. Here's Sunny and Cal holding Mari's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mari does so too. Used to making these friendly crowds. He came a little while, but he's getting there. They admire his persistence. <gasps> Aww! It's raining super hard today. It, it, it rained always to come out of nowhere. It's, the rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Our parents may take a, photo, a picture of her with her new raincoat. It's a paper color, pink. I really want to kill under the umbrella, but Kale seems to be taking it just fine. This is adorable as fuck! I really like how the rain tastes. It's Kale being Kale again. He went to Hobie's, but the shopper told the Kale to leave his jacket outside since he was getting all his comics wet. Alright, shopkeep. He's being pretty busy at sc with school lately. We finally made some time to get together and go to the parking lot. Here's Kale, hanging his legs off a tree. He's like a climber. I would have as fearless as him. And here's the other world version of this. For the first time vacation, we all decided to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon Zopper is favorite. 
Just cooling up some refreshing orange juice, Joe. We can't get too close. We might get the camera wet. Kyle's known to spill his drinks. You're very sunny and sand. For everybody, it looks like he's enjoying himself. Maybe he's gonna need help getting out. I guess I'll keep it company till then. Yay, yeah, Sunny's turning 12 today! Even though, even though me and Sunny Aubrey are in the same school year, Sunny's younger than all of us. So, assuming four years has passed, you would be 16 now. It's the big EB of the group, so we have to take care of him. Sunny's holding a super huge present from Mario and Hero. I wonder what it is. You can't really tell from the photo, but Mario and Hero got Sunny a giant box building block set. Sunny seems much more interested in the box, though. He actually took Mario's new kid in the Amiibo. Sunny will leave the box. I can put a food bowl inside. In the box it will be Sunny and Mewo's new home. We're going to beetle catching today. We just kill ready to pounce on the next victim. Oh, and Sunny's there too. He looks kind of sleepy. I went to the bathroom and came back to this photo. He also took a picture of himself with Anthony and I don't And there's the other version of this photo. The rest has to go today. So, me, Sunny, and Cal and Aubrey are brought up in early. This is adorable! Aubrey is so photogenic. Goodbye, Summer. Till next year. And I'll have open spaces for new photos. Unless there are missing photos. Oh, man. Looks like a lot of the photos are still missing. Maybe I'll break them for herself. I have to go build back later. On the bright side, Look how short I was. <laughs> I know I've gonna leave the foot since you were left for college. Can't wait until he comes back. This year, I'll be I'll finally be the taller brother. <laughs> <sighs> Anyways. The thread about the missing photos, Basso. Maybe Sunny will take care of things for you. Just focus on going back to your happy carefree self. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Sorry about the way dinner's taking on there, Don. Would any of you guys like to help? Yeah, sure, I'll help. Got some experience helping Bird cook and stuff. Oh, that'd be lovely. Please follow me to the kitchen if this way. Uh, oh, hi, Sonny.